The normal human chest is oval shaped. If I was to do a transverse cut through the chest and look down bird's eye view, what you'll see is the chest is shaped like an oval. The anterior posterior diameter or the front to back length is less than the lateral or side to side. If I was to do a measurement here, the anterior posterior length or diameter is typically 23 centimeters. If I was to do the lateral diameter, this would be 31 centimeters. If I was to do a ratio, so 23 divided by 31, this would give me 0.74. The normal ratio of the adult chest is between 0.7 to 0.75 as a ratio. In the phenomenon known as barrel chest in, the anterior posterior diameter approaches that of the lateral. For example, the anterior posterior is 26 centimeters, whilst the lateral decreases to 29 centimeters. The ratio here is now 0.9. Therefore, in barrel chesting, the ratio is anything above 0.9 as a ratio. The proposed mechanisms of what causes barrel chesting is a couple. Firstly, the accessory muscles in the neck that help with breathing, such as the scalenes or the sternocleidomastoid, causes um, a pulling up of the ribs, higher ribs, the clavicle and the sternum, as well as the hyperinflation of the lungs, which gives a barrel chesting appearance. The common conditions that cause barrel chesting is chronic obstructive pulmonary disease, especially emphysema, but barrel chesting can be part of the normal aging process.